Their history includes three Stanley Cups on the back of one of the best goaltenders in history. Now it's the present and these Devils of New Jersey. Hi everyone with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro coming along in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich. A lot of people have clicked through the turnstiles tonight and they've had in mind one player. He's the guy on whom all eyes will be. What's it like to be him? Well, you want that pressure. You want to be the guy. When the game is on the line, you want to be the guy that has the puck on your stick. And that's why people pay a lot of money to come watch this particular player play. Because when he's at his best, his team goes to another level. Hall's shown throughout his career, pretty much at every level of hockey, that he loves the extra attention and responsibilities that come from being one of the stars for his team. It's not easy being the guy every night, but he seems to enjoy it when all the eyes are on him. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders for the game. Corey Schneider gets the start, developed with the U.S. national team, then Boston College, then the American Hockey League, then Vancouver, then with the legend Marty Brodeur. He's learned his trade well. Robin Leonard turned the AHL on its side in 2011, leading the Binghamton Senators to the Calder Cup Championship and won the Jack A. Butterfield Trophy as playoff MVP. We are ready for the first face-off of the night. Tonight's game has begun in New Jersey. Slid to Hall. A shot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. That is a great display of goaltending there, Doc. Good place to shoot from, and he does. They score! Wow, that's getting on the board fast. Well, they jumped up on the bench beside me pretty quickly here. Very excited on the one side to have the game's first goal. The Islanders have broken the scoreless tie early. And that's a face-off win. Scored by number two. Let's a shot go. Got in the way of that one. Matthew Barza. Puck is thrown to Lee. Stole that pass. Snaps a wrist shot. That puck was obstructed by a screen. And he fires. New Jersey skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Gains the zone. Parked in the slot. He got the outside of the post. He's got that one measured in the attacking zone. And he hammers one. Wonderful save. Chip to Heischer. Can he beat him here? They score! And they've tied the game up. You get the lead, you want to pin the lead down. You want to give yourself the opportunity to spread the lead out. But they don't. They give up the tying goal. And now we're back to even. Just over seven minutes have been skated here in the first. And so it is one to one. New Jersey's won that faceoff and possession established. Goes back deep for it. The Islanders are driving it from the wing. Save! Oh, he put it in his own net. It counts against him. Man, Doc, I don't know what he is thinking. This is a blackout shot into his own net. I, I can't even come up for an excuse for what he is doing here. He needs to sit down and think about it. New York's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. And they take that neutral zone face off. Shoots one. Wonderful stop. 
laid on to Palmieri. Steps in from the neutral zone. Lightning in that glove. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Looking to Coleman. Good place to shoot from. Save! The Islanders are skating it up at neutral ice. And a save! I love when the game is like this. Everybody has to think. Everybody has to react. There's no time to slow the game down. Fires. Save there. Skates it into the zone. Waffle boarded. New Jersey's along the wing at center ice. Turned a shot on net. Great save. Propelled to Ajo. The Islanders, through the neutral zone, accelerate to the line. Save! Picks it up in his own end. New Jersey's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Wow, what force in that one. Had a coach once tell me, hit or be hit tonight. I'd rather be the hitter on this one. And he gains the zone. Blocked. The clock has bled down to the last minute. In the first period. Important interception there. And he sends it to the net. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. First period is finished. Both teams scored. But there is a lead to carry into the locker room. Hockey's narrowest lead is what we have here. One goal. Be sure to attend our auto and light truck show next weekend and get a sneak peek at next year's models. New York's got the lead at the end of the period, and their goaltender has made a huge difference in that. Here's just an example of his body of work. We'll be right back. off of period two. Trying to go to Hall. Gains that offensive line. Let's it go. What a save. I was looking for the light to come on. And yet another save. How does he do that? Amazing reflexes. Lockered away. Oh, and the puck winds up back at center ice. Man. Looking from the corner. All a part of generating an offense. A little pass off from the goal. Can start the attack going in the zone. A backhand shot. Save. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Under five minutes have passed. The Islanders with a narrow lead of two to one. New Jersey's got that neutral zone faceoff. They've got an on man rush, so they want to keep it simple. Outstanding save, difficult opportunity. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Gets a little drop off from the goalie here. The Islanders skate it up on the side. Let's it go. He wore that puck on a hard shot. I'm generally a guy that's entertained by lots of goals and low. In all alone. He shuts it right down. The Islanders are at the wing in neutral lines. Got a piece of that one. Moving it to Nosen. Let's it go. That was a great play and goal. New York's lugging it up the wing. Sacrificial play on that block shot. And now it's directed to Coleman. One on one. A solo rush. Score! And the game is even.
Well, I guess this game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. Neutralized face-off win. In with it now. Shoots. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. Fantastic setup and equally great stop by the goaltender. They score! That's two unanswered goals. Well, this has been pretty good back and forth here in a tie game. Now they've got the lead. We'll see what they do with it. The Devils have broken the tie, and we're still in the second period. Much uncertainty about which way this game's going to go. The Islanders got that faceoff win. Now what? Blake fires a shot. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Send up the wing to Hall. Look out, the hits are coming. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Gains the blue line. Got the save there. So satisfying to have delivered a hit like that. Down here, you can hear this hit throughout the rink. Clean win on the draw. Pitching it to Hall. On to Brat. Looks from the corner. A shot. Blocked with a pad. Gets in and he'll look over his options. Deflected off the blocker. That is up close and personal. I really like the effort that he's trying there to generate a turnover by finishing his check. Wonderful stop. Pass attempt to Coleman. Gathered up again by Boychuk. And he shoots one. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Through two periods, here are the shots on goal. Get ready. 21 for New Jersey and 14 for the New York Islanders. The Devils have a lead. It is just one, and they did it this way. We'll be right back. Thank you for your generosity. Forty minutes have been played. They are getting ready for the third period here. So take us back through the game. What do you think, Eddie? New Jersey's dominated in the scoring chances, Doc, through the first 40 minutes of play. They're only up by one here in the third. Let's see how they come out and start this period. And the whistle signals an offside. New Jersey's got another faceoff win. Slid to Brat. He throws it there. The big pillows came in handy. Laid up that right side to Everly. Shoots one, and a save. Pitching this one to Hall. Tremendous hit. Even when the puck's on your stick, you better know where everybody is on the ice. Quick wrist shot, blockered away. Skill play by Letty. Chip to Everly. Snapping a pass to Lee. A great wrist shot. The lane was jammed, and it hit somebody. 
Strong wrister. Moved along and in. A hit that can make you mad. Hall's not very happy after taking that huge hit. He wasn't aware who was around, and he paid the price. Schneider's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. Over seven minutes have been played. The Devils with a lead of only one, three goals to two. New York's got a defensive zone win. The Islanders with a neutral zone possession along the wing. Nice work by Bailey. Let's it go. Just missed the net. We sometimes forget the speeds these guys are playing at. Score! And this one is tied. I guess at this point, guys, it doesn't really matter what the game looks like. It's back to even square, and we'll find out who's going to take the lead next. New York scored a goal to get this game tied, and the clock is now the enemy of neither, but the friend of us fans. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Good shooting place. Save there. New Jersey setting up an offense from the wing. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Great save. If we had games like this more often, nobody would be talking about how difficult it is to score goals anymore in the National Hockey League. But as it stands tonight, this is a goal after goal after goal game. Solid clean win. The Devils have gotten to the neutral zone. Brings it in for an attack. Receives it in the corner. Good use of the stick. Broke that pass up. New York's carrying on up the wing. Quick wrister. Routine save, but a necessary one. Up the left side to Coleman. And he dumps it in. New York's in their own end, and they've got it. Directing that one to Barzell. A shot. Good save there. Passing one off now to Zaka. It's an onside play. Brings a shot. Great save at the edge of the crease. Now that's a solid save. Punched away. The Islanders skated up on the side. Pass comes to him from the crease. Laid on to Coleman. Last minute to go in the third. The Islanders luck that along in their own end. And it's a good pickup. Propelled to Everly. Flings it. That puck struck him in front. The Devils have it along the side at mid-ice. It's dumped in. Puck is thrown to Bailey. Takes it in from the neutral zone. That's a good save on an easy shot. On to Heischer. Oh, and it's a penalty coming. A huge moment in the game. Could it swing on this penalty? Boychuk's going to the penalty box, and the call is a boarding minor. These are the type of plays, Doc, that we want to eliminate from the game where the attacking player has no chance to protect himself when getting hit from behind. The Devils get a critical power play opportunity, and it's their very first one in the game. It begins with this face-off. Well, the power play's excited to get out there. Those guys just about scrambled onto the ice as they get their initial chance of this game. He's got that point pass. Shoots it on. Pad block, nice save, tough to follow. And the horn ends regulation. There's more coming up in overtime. 
The good old days of hockey are back. Vintage jerseys are now... Letty's a forceful person, and he proved it by scoring this goal that forces us all into the excitement of overtime in just a moment. Period begins, power play time continues. Let's see if the penalty killers can do the job. New York's on the move in the defensive zone. And that one has cleared more time off that penalty clock as they drop back and wait for another rush. Let's it go, outstanding body contact. Crushing hit there, Doc. Everybody in the building took notice of that. Clock leading down on the power play. The Islanders' penalty killers come up big here in overtime. The penalty is over. Outlet up the middle to Heischer. Looking to Boychuk. Oh, bad giveaway there. In that defensive zone, an important play. Trying to go to Boychuk. Leads that charge into the zone. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Collected by Philpola. Now nah, that pass has got to be better than that. Everybody has to get back. Slid to Everly. That's terrific work with the pass. Oh, he saved his team there. Oh, they needed a whistle badly because the puck was loose in the crease and he was able to put his glove on it. Letty's shoulder absolutely annihilates him as he goes into the ice. They win the draw. Now can they get it out? Terrific determination by Bailey. Waffle boarded. Shot on. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Saved with the pad. Collected in the corner. Holds at the point. Looking for options. Score! The overtime winner. And the players spill over the boards to celebrate. And we have a winner from this hero in overtime. Bailey's quick wrist shot surprised the goaltender in close. Sometimes the shot's just too perfect. We say it oftentimes uh, the other way around where a player gets a terrific chance and the goalie just beats him. It's in reverse this time. The goalie just couldn't get there. Some nights are special in memory. This one was an outstanding game. So long for now.